welcome back to the office once again uh, here at New Traditions Dulcimers and Woodcrafts. Uh, my name is Dan Daniels and once again we're looking at a, uh, a teardrop dulcimer that is headed down to Texas um, to a customer who ordered two of these, one for himself and one for his wife. This is number 864. Let me get the other one here to show you the difference. This is 863 over here and this is 864. 863 has a one and a half, 864 does not. And as you can see, the, uh, the sound holes are a little bit different so they can tell them apart. Um, yeah, so anyways, hang on. Sorry about that. So this is number 864. Oregon Myrtle, once again, master grade Oregon Myrtle. Check out that. That is a beautiful back. Again, reclaimed wood. If you watched the video on 863, you, you've heard the story of how this wood comes about. Back and sides, Oregon Myrtle with Port Orford Cedar Top. And again, I just, I wish I could let you guys see the, or allow it, somehow figure out how I can get you guys to see the beauty in this wood. It's almost like a, a quilted maple, but it's a cedar. Also reclaimed from the forest of um, southern Oregon, southwestern Oregon, along the ocean, Pacific Ocean, and northern California. Three-piece Oregon Myrtle headstock. And I did the same thing with the, the strap pins on this. I turned a couple of of strap pins for them out of the same wood, which I'm going to do on all my instruments from now on out. I'm not going to put any of those ugly metal uh, strap pins on anymore. <laughs> those things are just, they were atrocious and they're, they're, they just, I don't like them. So I will always use the, the wood. This is the same, this is wood from the same log that, that I get with my Oregon Myrtle. So it's, this comes from the same tree. Not that that makes a whole lot of difference to anybody other than me and perhaps the customer. Uh, maple fingerboard with a Wenge fingerboard overlay, 25 inch VSL, great sounding instruments. I'm really enjoying these teardrops, it's 25 inch teardrops. I, I, um, I'm kind of thinking this is going to be our standard instrument. I, I love the, the shape, I love the sound, um, I have two Two that are being built right now. One is a black walnut and the other is a cherry. And I'm going to be starting in January two that are going to be koa. That will also be teardrop. With uh, The koas will have straight grain spru uh, spruce tops. Quarter song. Anyways, great sounding instruments and this is how this one sounds. Number 864, Oregon Myrtle, back and sides. 25 inch VSL, um, Port Orford Cedar, sounds a little bit like this.
to be all spinal tappy on you all, but the sustain on these instruments is just amazing. It, it's really intriguing the, what this cedar can do. And then I've, I've got special new traditions bracing on the inside as well to, to help with the sound and help with the sustain. But the sustain on these guys is really something. So anyways, that's it. These are the last two that will be uh, done in 2020. It has been an amazing year here at New Traditions, just an incredible year. 2020 has been um, memorable in many ways, but for our business and for me personally and for my wife uh, and for our family, it's been such a blessed year. And I, I praise God for all of our customers. We thank you so much. Thank you for all of those who have been, who have been watching our videos on YouTube. And if, if you like our videos and you like the content and you wanna support us, our business and our ministry, Subscribe to those videos and click the little notification bell and you'll be notified every time a new video comes out. It really helps us a lot. Um, more, than, more than most people know, YouTube is a, a really viable way for small businesses to uh, offset years like 2020 with, um, with very sketchy business <clears throat> sales and things like that. However, all that to say, uh, this has been a 2020 has been a record year for us as a builder. I've built so many instruments this year and then our wood turning part of the, the business has been going through the roof. We have product that went to China this year, two orders to China. Um, and no, no jokes are needed there. Um, we have product that went to California, to Oregon, to uh, these guys are going to Texas. We've had several instruments go to Florida. Oklahoma, one to two to Kentucky, three to West Virginia. Nope, nope, nope. North Carolina. Um, I mean, we've just shipped instruments all over all over the United States, and we've shipped orders all over the world in 2020. So, all that to say, uh, thank you to all of our customers. You guys have been faithful to New Traditions since 1982. Uh, we we love each and every one of you, and we praise God every day for for our, our wonderful support and the customers that we have. Number 864 and 863 down there on the floor at my feet, um, both going down to, to Texas for a husband and wife team down there. Thanks again for the great year. 2020 has is, is just been amazing. We're excited to see what 2021 is going to bring. Um, with great anticipation and great hope, we, we don't fret here at uh, New Traditions as I look at the fretboard of my dulcimer there's no sense in fretting there's no sense in worrying about tomorrow because today has enough worries of its own as the bible would say so that's it check us out online at our website www.newtraditionsdulcimers.com check us out on facebook at new traditions homestead and our youtube channel and subscribe to our videos you can get to our youtube channel through this video uh, check it out shop around subscribe you can hear each and every almost each and every adult instrument that I've built on YouTube. Um, if you want to get in contact with us, there's a contact form on our, on our website. Uh, we don't really accept phone calls or drop bys at this point, just because of, of the way our, our shop is set up. But um, that's it, I'm rambling. Lord bless you guys, have a great and Merry Christmas. See you next time, see you in 2021.